Yo, what's up gamers? It's Nick here, back at it again. And today I'm fixing to show y'all how to turn any low-end phone into a dang powerhouse. I'm talking 144 FPS, Ultra HD graphics, and buttery smooth gameplay. And we're doing it with the brand spanking new Speed X Game Booster version 2.0. Trust me, y'all don't want to miss this. Now listen here, I know the struggle. Lag spikes, frame drops, and that old potato phone barely keeping up with them heavy shooters or open world games. But today, we're putting that phone on steroids, baby. With SpeedX 2.0, you'll go from struggling at 30 FPS to playing smoother than warm butter sliding on a pancake. First up, let's talk about feature breakdown. So at game setting options, we got auto boost, to keep your phone at peak performance. Then we got smooth Android UI. GPU composition and kicks in for better rendering power. V-Sync tuning, kill background apps. And my fav tweak is switching OpenGL and Vulkan rendering profiles. Perfect for different games depending on what they crave. Next up, we talk the game list options. And y'all ain't ready for this. The X gaming mode cranks up your device. If you want longer playtime, flip to battery mode. Y'all wanna go wild? Overclock from 60 to 144 FPS. That's right, y'all. Triple digit frames on a phone most folks call low end. Oh, and the best part? Unlocking graphics from smooth up to ultra HD. And if you're still hungry for more speed, flip on speed mode. It's like hitting nitro boost in Fast and Furious. Now, quick heads up y'all. You do need Shizuku permission for this magic to work. But don't sweat it. I left a handy link down in the description so you can set that up in just a couple minutes. Now download these tools from link in the descriptions or pinned comments. Please watch the download tutorial if you're confusing how to get them. But if you want to get easy access, then join the membership. Trust me, it'll worth and really fast. And alright, once you've ready, now let's jump to the tutorial section. First of all, let's open Zarchiver or any file manager app. Next, go to download folder. Now, click that files you've been download and extract them here. Now install SpeedX Game Booster. And as you can see, these app is 100% safe. Alright, now let's jump to Shizuku app. And as usual, we need to grant these permission first. So check link in the descriptions how to get these permission quickly. Once Shizuku is ready, now click at Authorize App and turn on SpeedX. Okay, now let's jump into the app. Y'all keep in mind to allowing all showed permissions to avoid any mistake and click at Done options after you applied them one by one. Once you've set them up, now chose any game you want to tweak. For just example, I'll play Call of Duty, so I click these one. Alright, now click at Game List right here, and turn on all these tweaks. Also, chose at Vulcan Rendering for extra smooth gameplay. Now let's go back a bit and click at Game Setting. Click these logo right here, and chose Gamer X mode for heavy games, and Battery mode for casual one. Next up, add just these FPs little bit higher than your own in-game FPS. Here I got 90 FPS in Call of Duty. So, I need to crank it to 120, and so on. Next up, chose Smooth Graphic for extra fluidly gameplay. Also, don't forget to enable speed mode right here. Okay, now just click start game and you'll automatically log in. And alright guys, you can also get extra tweaks by click these floating icon. 
Enable some features you need just like a ping optimization or instant RAM cleaner and other. And once everything is ready, now fire up and see the real performance boost. Alright guys, once y'all flip that SpeedX switch, boom! Super smooth graphics with higher FPS, no lags and stutter anymore. This is running like a flagship phone, y'all. So if y'all are tired of lag, stuttering, and playing at them weak low settings, it's time to level up with SpeedX Game Booster 2.0. Download it, set it up, and thank me later when your phone's out here flexing like a thousand dollar gaming rig. Alright, and there you have it. If you found this video helpful, I'll appreciate it if you hit that thumbs up, share it with your low-end buddy, do subscribe, and ring that bell, so you never miss out on tips and tricks to boost your low-end gaming performance. And also let me know in the comments which game you're gonna try out first with these tweaks. This is Nick, signing off. Keep them games smooth, and them wins coming. Catch you later.